I want to be honest about my YouTube is it's gonna be like I said a visual diary but it's gonna be everything that I love I love I might just sit and talk to y'all about nothing one day <laughs> And like, you know, if, like if y'all watch, it's just like, well, thank you. I said all of this to say, I will not be niching down. <laughs>welcome to my channel if you're you know new and if you're old welcome back to my channel oh my god happy new year y'all this is my first vlog of 2024 and i'm sitting in my closet well one of my closets and it's actually the first time doing my makeup at my vanity and um i wanted to just talk to you guys like really vlog and talk to you guys first of all how y'all doing hope y'all doing good this vlog is just really just going to be about one me getting ready because i have to go um see my friend for his birthday and then two the other part is just me talking about my youtube revamp i'm revamping my youtube and the biggest thing for me right now is i've always wanted to be a youtuber from the beginning of my start so shout out to the ogs that have been following me since back 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 in college grad school you know and now i'm grown in my own apartment working and i still haven't done the things that i said i was going to do youtube wise and um well if you if you're watching this vlog you already seen that <laughs> Your girl got a new intro <laughs> and when the video ends, you're going to see a new outro. <laughs> what I am like super excited about is like just talking to y'all about how trying to make my YouTube grow more sophisticated, more me fit my current aesthetic that I'm at right now in this place. Like, and I've also made little strives of, you know, doing stuff like changing my nails. Like I don't do those a lot of like the abstract nail art that I used to do, like really extravagant. Now it's just like, I'm kind of basic. I wanted to create just one established look for me. And maybe at my birthday, I'll spice it up a little bit. But like, for the most part, I'm like, you know, nails, this is either gonna be this or it's going to be like just nude new polish and that's it sorry like i'm looking this way and this way so like don't pay attention just listen to what i'm saying 2023 was a big pivotal transition year for me um just really figuring out who i was like who i am what things i want to work on as a person how am i gonna grow you know for the better and i really just focused and honed in on like a couple of key things so first i made a big vision board and i'm so happy because i never had the de desire to make a vision board my vision board has so many things on it and one of it is being mentally and physically healthy and um i have a therapist first of all y'all it's 2024 if you don't got a therapist by now baby what are you doing get you one you're welcome <laughs> But like, I love my therapist because she really does. She talks to me and she gives, she tells me to give myself grace, but she also gets me together, right? So she'll tell me like, are you making time for you? Are you doing the things like that make you happy? And so that's what I've been trying to work on a lot as well. It's like, am I doing the things that make me happy? Am I really out here doing the things that just... I can calm, like calm down from work or do stuff like am I really doing that so that's been the biggest thing right let's run it back on my therapist real quick sis be really really like get into me that I need to be doing stuff that makes me happy and not solely working like because if you don't know I work like 50 11 billion jobs <laughs> um my life is crazy and yes it's great to be financially stable but honestly work has made me miss out on a lot of stuff one of my things was making sure that 
I do things that make me happy, making sure that I'm spending time with myself. And one of the things that make me happy is YouTube, vlogging, y'all, y'all make me happy. And I'm actually uh, like disappointed in myself to say that I need to do better. And I wanna apologize to y'all because there are so many opportunities where I, where I thought like, oh, I'm just, I'm gonna be more consistent. I'm gonna be more consistent. And then I don't do it. Y'all have been there time and time again, watch my videos, watching my YouTube shorts, all of those things. And I'm very grateful. So my thing is like, I want this. I need to put in the work but it's not even work to me because it feels fun. But for to work so many jobs and to like have so many things in place and not always busy with something that is for something else, I need something in my life that's just for me. That's one of the reasons why um, I'm back on YouTube <laughs> because I'm, I'm making more time for me. Like if you've been following some of my shorts or stuff, like if you follow me on Instagram or if you follow me on TikTok, you could tell that I've been going on solo dates or like doing little things like that. That's one of the things that I said in my vision board that I was going to do, like make time for me, make time for things that make me happy. So, but just having a YouTube that fits who I am currently is so important because yeah the intro that i had currently it was it was so cute <laughs> it was like three little me's um talking to each other um but it was mad long it felt really collegey it didn't feel like me now and i was like yeah no i just i don't have any updated videos i don't have any updated things for my intro and i need to make this better so that's what i did i will be also posting youtube videos long form and short form youtube has shorts so i'll be you know focusing on that still posting on tiktok but i've kind of let instagram go i post every now and then but like for real you still can follow me on instagram the second thing that i said that was like really important to me this year was getting closer to god and listening to god really having a relationship on my vision board wrote down not only things that i wanted to do this year but like prayers and on the back of the photos and like i prayed over my new year i prayed over the days and it's like honestly i've been happier i've been happier going to god in the mornings and doing 10 things that i'm grateful for instead of complaining to god about dang god you didn't give me this you didn't give me that like really changing my perspective and falling in love with God. It has been a changer in how I go about my everyday life and it's changed my mood. I don't dwell on the things I don't have. You know, sometimes they do creep the little thoughts. They creep in my mind. <laughs> like, I'll be like, dang, or um, I don't dwell on it so bad or I don't think about all the mean things somebody has said to me in the past as much as I used to with you know changing my perspective and really falling in love with god like i used to be really mad all the time you know i feel like that was part of my depression but i don't know like now i just i feel light i feel airy i feel a little happy <laughs> um and i i love that for me I, I like the fact that i can i can talk about this and talk about like how life is going and so i'm just really excited about that I'm excited about, about getting closer to God. I found a church. I want to serve in the church and because it's been it's been a pivotal element of me growing closer to God. Like that church, the people, the pastor, they've all been just really, really instrumental in my growth. So I'm reintroducing myself <laughs> 1000% on YouTube. Um, I don't think I'm gonna delete my YouTube videos, like the old ones, um, but I am developing a certain aesthetic of how my like cover photos will look or not really edits because I feel like this is just a visual diary. Like I just wanna be real, it's, it's a visual diary. Like I wanna show y'all me, like what I like to do, what I love to do. I feel like I'm a unicorn. Like I like a lot of creative stuff. I like DIYs. I've been redoing my apartment. Like um, I like style, y'all know this. Like there's so many different things, many elements of me that I wanna show y'all. Like I wanna start being a little bit more vulnerable. I have a friend, that's like my, my biggest supporters, which are my friends. But I really wanna shout out like 
um my friend yana because like we've been talking back and forth i think it's been today like we were talking about youtube and like she lives in shot town and shout out to shot town but like we were talking and about being more vulnerable with the people on youtube because it's just like y'all come to see us like y'all really y'all really come to see us and you subscribe to our channels you watch our videos you comment you sub like all these different things why not be vulnerable with you why not tell you the things that that upset me when i show you the weak moments i don't want to always show you the happy moments because that's not like how life is for me right now i'm happy but next next week i could be sad i'm not claiming that for me jesus but i mean like you never know i want to talk about you know like my life in the dmv like she gave me a good idea about living alone like those are things we need to talk about like i may not have good advice but just listening to my testimony and and my journey may help some of y'all and that's what i'm on youtube to do like to help I want to feel like y'all's big sister for the younger ones and maybe your cousin for the older ones that are watching me, you know? I just want to be that change, you know? If I can help that one person, that one girl or that one guy who's watching me and be like, dang, I want to embark on this journey. I have nowhere to start. Like, use me as a template. I want to be honest about my YouTube. It's, it's going to be, like I said, a visual diary, but it's going to be everything that I love like literally everything that i love i might just sit and talk to y'all about nothing one day <laughs> and like you know if, like if y'all watch it's just like well thank you <laughs> if, if you watch i'll be like well thanks for watching but yeah like i, I want y'all to be not only entertained but to take something from it whether that's a new recipe or you know um a new lesson in life or just so many different things i want y'all to be inspired to do things and sometimes i don't have nothing to do there are some days where i sit at the house and i am chilling and i have nothing to do and we just gonna sit and chill together there are days where i have long days of just work i work so much i might take you behind the scenes of my work day or there are days where i don't have i could probably clean up and y'all clean up with me like there are so many things that we could talk about i feel like i've talked about the, a little bit of this but like my dating life i've also taken an account of all the things i've done on youtube and like some of the stuff was just like really young like i did some interviews with shooting your shot like girl you really didn't care about that <laughs> i've done like little advice blogs with friends which was cool but like i guess what i'm saying is i'm trying to I'm t I took an account of everything I've done and the things that make me happy the most, which is like style, which is like vlogs, which is, you know, lifestyle and cooking and traveling, I haven't done. Y'all, I went to Italy. Did I, did I vlog that? Probably not, but it's on my YouTube shorts. I went to Italy, whole Italy, six, six beautiful cities in Italy with my with my family and it was the most amazing experience i could ever have hold on my eyelash is not sticking just one second because baby oh hold on oh 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 she needs she needs more glue one one thousand percent i gotta work on the lighting up in here because it's it's not that great oh girl focus <laughs> focus <laughs> drop the glue okay let's see if i can stick it on here now oh it stuck oh it didn't okay it stuck i think i think it looks like the uh okay i think it's stuck. Cause if you don't stick them right like they for real do they'll be coming up in front of people and that's the most embarrassing thing that's so embarrassing yo eyelashes just boing <laughs> just just live up lift up like a dump truck okay and be like oh i'm here then i wear the hard eyelashes like the ones with the invisible band because they look more natural and like Oh, oh, oh. They're they're on. They're they're on. So sorry. 
so sorry i sidetracked took an account of of the things i was posting and it was just like i don't i'm not like that no more and i'm not gonna start a whole new youtube i like the way that y'all can see my evolution of who i've come to as an adult as like 27 year old morgan sinclair <laughs> um yeah i'm 27 <laughs> i'm i'm happy to say like y'all have been here from from the beginning if you have been here for the beginning but if you came in the middle or if you came at the end it don't matter thank you for being here i said all of this to say i will not be niching down <laughs> i feel like that's a whole summary of everything that i just talked about one i'm getting closer to god i'm living a happy and healthier life too um mentally and physically and i will not be niching down nor will not be letting up on youtube now do not hold me to how many times i'm gonna say i'm i want to post okay because i want to post one time every week i want to post every every week don't hold me to that <laughs> do do not hold me to that because i'm telling y'all when i said i work a lot i work 50 11 jobs i work 50 11 jobs and yeah your girl gotta live um uh, it is expensive out here in the dmv and uh your girl don't want to be broke amen to the saints out loud if you feel me if you feel how i feel type in the chat amen put some fires emojis in the chat amen <laughs> also one big thing that i really want to say is um i want to take you behind the scenes of like my creative planning process because I really like planning doing anything creative but I also like the creative planning like organization creative events um one big thing is my sister is getting married she's engaged yay and I'm so happy for her because as a sister uh I've always wanted my sister to have everything she wants in life she found her future bae future husband and a future husband she's getting married and i am the maid of honor duh um <laughs> so your girl has been planning her bachelorette her wedding shower and helping planning the wedding so i put together a whole strategic plan for the wedding for the bridal shower for the um bachelorette so we can know what to do and not lose sight of the vision and baby when I tell you that thing is iron tight and good, it's good. And then the planning process has been really, not only has it been kind of stressful, but it's been good for me because I'm able to see the behind the scenes of what needs to go into actual wedding planning. Cause I mean, one day I'm gonna have to plan my own wedding. Instead of being blindsided by the whole process, I'm glad that my sister is letting me in on so much. She kind of has no choice if she's in school, but it doesn't matter. I'm glad she's letting me in on on helping because your girl likes this process. So I, I want to show you what I planned and like doing the behind the scenes. Um, that's probably not going to come until later of the year because her whole like wedding shower is actually a secret for her. So you feel me but i'll show you behind the scenes of that and what we decorated and what we did like i want to show you all of that you know it may be in a youtube short because you know i can't always film but like it'll be it'll be here it'll be here on youtube so okay so yeah that's literally what i want to do <laughs> so i'm going to end the vlog here um i thank you guys so much for watching i hope i didn't babble on too much um and i hope you got something out of it um i hope you understood my vision for youtube from now and from years to come this doesn't mean like in years to come i'm not gonna revamp stuff you know and slightly tweak it but i feel like this is a whole new youtube like i don't know if that makes sense because it's a whole new i guess like way of me vlogging way of me doing stuff on youtube so i'm super excited for that um and i'm excited that i can share it with y'all and y'all can come along for the ride and like don't forget to comment like I see y'all's comments on the shorts but like comment on the long form stuff too like let me hear y'all's thoughts like let me know that y'all are here with me like it's just like really cool that I get to bring y'all along for the ride I'm, I'm so excited but I'm gonna end the vlog here and just say thank you to everybody thank you to current subscribers new subscribers and old subscribers I thank y'all for being here and we're gonna continue on happy 2024 i hope that this year is everything that you want it to be that god blesses you abundantly um that's my word for 2024 abundant 
and abundantly and an abundance um i really hope that this year for you is everything you need it to be and so i love you guys love you lots bye friends um i gotta go curl my hair <laughs> bye <laughs>